What's going on, y'all? JT here with a quick unboxing and look at some Gen Z's light bulbs. So, I've mentioned to you guys before, and I'll be the dead horse every time, that every time I get light bulbs, I'm going to actually do a quick unboxing on it. So, you guys can kind of see um, which light bulbs I'm getting and actually which truck or car I'm going to run it in. So, I particularly got these 4S light bulbs to run in my Arma Outcast 8S, but I also have several other cars as well that I can run these batteries and I have my Limitless which is a 4S capable car and then I also have my X-Max also as well which is an 8S capable um, truck as well so I will be running this these batteries in both of those cars as well so there's a link down in the description if you guys want to go over there and check out their site they have a whole bunch of different light bulbs for tons of different applications over there and they also have it kind of sorted out to where you can pick the type of car you're going to run it in, a terrain, on-road, off-road. And then they also kind of have it sorted by brands and stuff as well. So that kind of made me, it kind of made it easier to go in and select these type of lipos that I want to use and the type of car I was going to use or truck I was going to use it in. So uh, I'm just going to crack these open real quick and pull these out. And they are packed really nice. I get this open here. Pull this out and these are hard case lipos I hear that <laughs> so anyway uh, they do have the EC5 connector on there so this is going to be a direct fit right on my um, outcast 8s and then I also put EC5 on my X max and then also on my limitless as well so it's not going to be a problem of running these in any of those applications there and I always save these guys I don't know what you guys do but I save these sometimes for some of my other cars, I do put it down on underneath the battery for padding and stuff like that. So if the battery's kind of shifting back and forth in the car, um, I won't have to worry about um, it just ripping up, the, you know, the casing on the battery, just getting it dirty and stuff like that. So, and I did get, of course, two of these. I'll take this other one out real quick. And what I'm going to do is, while we got this out, got my lipo checker. And we're just going to check how balanced these cells are so you guys can see this. Uh, if I can plug this in right, it's got it upside down, JT. So you guys see there kind of how these are balanced 3.8, 3.8, 3 3.81, 3 3.81, 3 uh, 15.23. And let's see what this other one's at real quick. And... This one's at the same as well. 3.8, 3.8, 3.81, 8.1, and then 15.23. So these are balanced. They, they basically been in storage mode. So I'm going to get these bad boys uh, pretty much charged up and get them ready to run in my 8S cars. So like I said, guys, there's going to be a link down below in the description. They do have a large assortment of batteries. They have more batteries than what I thought they had. They got it for every application, even F <clears throat> excuse me even fbb applications and stuff as well so that was kind of interesting how they have different batteries for everything so that was kind of funny too real quick story um one of my friends went to a motocross event like about a week week and a half ago and he said he saw some guys using gen Z's batteries for jumpers and for starters and stuff like that and they were hooking them up to start bikes up stuff it was crazy he was telling me, i said you take pictures but he didn't but I didn't know people use these for that. And a friend of mine actually sometimes uses batteries to jumpstart a car and stuff like that. So these batteries do have a lot of applications, of course, with them. But that's just a real quick story for that. But anyway, guys, um, I'm going to get these chars up and get these running in my truck and in my cars in the next day or two. And I'll let you guys know how to perform, of course, with that. So uh, don't forget to like, subscribe and stay tuned for more videos. Thanks for watching.